how would you send an automatic reply to any of your Facebook posts at your Facebook page? Well, this can be easily done with ManyChat using the Command Growth Tool. And in this video, I will show you how you can easily do it, set it up so that when people comment in your post, in your Facebook page, automatically a reply will be sent or a message will be sent to the person that actually put in the comment. Now, before I get started, if you're new to this channel, hi, I'm Ken and I talk a lot about digital marketing. And if you're interested in topics like digital marketing or entrepreneurship, do subscribe and help this channel grow so that I can keep producing content like this to give more value to you and also to anyone that's watching this. So subscribe and hit the notification bell. And now let me go to my computer where I can show you step by step where you can set this up in ManyChat using the command growth tool. Hi, first of all, you log in into your ManyChat dashboard. So I've already logged into ManyChat. If you haven't set this up yet, all you have to do is just go to the link in the description box below, click it, register, and then immediately you can just uh, link to your Facebook page, right? As you can see, I'm still using a free version. So uh, even free version, you can do quite a lot of things as well, right? So next you go is go Growth Tools. So this is what I call the Facebook message Growth Tools. So you go to uh, new growth tools and just type. And then you go to Facebook comment 2.0, right? As you can read here, convert users to subscribers, launch A-B tests and create more complex automation for users who comment on your pages, Facebook posts. So this is what I meant. When somebody comment on your pages, Facebook posts, we will do the next action, right? So now let's just click on this. So as you can see, this growth tools will work with a specific post or all posts. That means uh, if there's, if you can only create one of these growth tools, one at a time, if you're using free version, a maximum can only create four. Uh, when you use the pro version, you can create as many as you want, but up to a certain number of subscription, then you will increase the price. But this is just for information. If you want to learn more, you can just go to the website and have a look, right? So I want to go just a specific post. Um, you can auto response. Uh, this is when people to reply in the comments and also the opt-in action, right? This one will go in later. Let's talk about settings first. So you select a post. So I have a few posts here, right? So this video I just set up. So let me just put a post. Let me just choose this post, right? So you can check, right? There's a few, there's scheduled posts as well. You just scheduled posts, promotable posts. See this ads post, dark post, booster post, and any other pro can be promoted via Facebook. So uh, basically all the posts, most of the posts or custom, if you have your Facebook custom, you, uh, the Facebook post uh, URL or ID, you can just put it here and then you can put here. I understand that command growth doesn't always work with add posts. It doesn't support event, post or jobs, report posts and posts for other pages. So this is just for your information, for you to know that there's is limit limitation. It is not hundred percent. You can do anything that you want, right? So now you go to publish post. So I choose this post, right? And then make sure this is not not ticked. Uh, track first level comment only. What does it mean, right? Uh, for example, some people might type PM or more info, right? Then the then after that, there's people replying to that track, right? So for this, when you tick it on, they only track the first level. They don't track the second level where all the replies are going on. So for me, I would prefer not to put it on. So, but it depends on how you use it. If you don't want people, if you don't want to track people that's on the reply part, then you can just ignore it, right? For me, put it in. So you can exclude comment. So I think this exclusion tools also you can put it in. You can set it in Facebook as well, which is good for filtering in case someone like to spam your your page with things like that. Because I have. More of my YouTube channel keep having spam because of this. Because I talk about Facebook ad, ad account disabled. So a lot of people spam my comment session. So, okay, you can include all these comments inside these keywords as well. Or you can only trigger for comment with this keyword. So for example, I type PM, right? This is, uh, for, for one country, it's very common. People like to type the word PM. Not sure why. Uh, when the information usually I put it in my copy. But when they type PM, then at least we can automatically have authorization to message them, right? To reply to them. So I just put the only trigger for comments with these keywords. So I just put comment, right? Later I'll show you how, how it works, right? You click next. So automatic like comments, right? Reply on comments. Just for example, something like this, right? Then you click next. Opt-in action, right? So what happened? 
when they put in their information, then when they put in the word PM, then they opt in, then they can receive a, a message, right? They first add in. So you have many things. Thank you for your thought and conversation. Click the option below to start, type or start. So you usually they only need to click on something, uh, whether get started uh, or maybe they, they start replying something, or when they type a reply to start, right? So you can please put something. Thank you for adding your thoughts to the com I just will again thank you for your interest. Then if would you like to receive content from us via Messenger, click the option below to type or type a reply to start and we will send you the video. Something like that. Well, whether if you are giving uh, a free gift and things like that, you can just do it that, right? You can just put the information there, right? Then you see, you can only contain one content block, right? Hmm. So free version can only have one com content block. So you cannot do anything, you just put a quick reply. Yes, please, for example. Done. Right? Then you can go to here. Thank you for confirming. To you can put to receive your free gift. Do click on this button or for in my case to watch more video, go to this YouTube channel. For example, right? And then you just click publish. Done. This is how you can do it. Of course, if you're using pro version, there's more things you can do. There's user form. So this is important because when you have a user form, what you can do is when you can you can collect information like email, phone number, and things like that. Uh, so this is these are quite cool features that you can have, right? So now it's still draft. Then you just click active. Widget activated. And it's done, right? So it's active. All right, so now let me test it out and let you sh show you how this can be done. So you go to the post here. So this is the post. Uh, you just have to type the word PM. Yeah, as you can see, hey Ken, thank you for your interest. Would you like the additional content for us? Yeah, this is exactly what I've, I've written here, right? Uh, this I'm not so sure I have not put in there yet, but you can see here, it's here. Thank you for your interest. Would you like to receive additional content from us, right? And then you just say yes, please. And you say thank you for confirming to watch more video, go to the YouTube channel. This YouTube channel is clear on here. And ta-da. Hi. Right. So this is how easily you can set up. The moment you type something, then people reply to you, right? Uh, let me just refresh this to see whether any any new messages from there or not. There. Can you see? Can you see? It's being liked by the page. And you see, thank you for interest. We will PM you shortly. So it's all here. Right? Right? So this is how easy it is to set up the ManyChat growth tools. Right? That's it. Thank you. Yep. That is how you set up the command growth tool in ManyChat. It is not that difficult and if you want to have more posts, because I think if you're not using pro version, you can only have one up to four maximum. So if you want more posts, you can just use uh, ManyChat Pro. You can get the ManyChat in the link in the description box below. Uh, it is an affiliate link. So if, if you want to just get it separately also, it's possible. I'm okay with that. But if you can support this channel, that would be great. And the pro version is not that expensive. So you can want, if you want, you can just get it right to have more options that you can use for these growth tools but even for free version you can just use it for now which is i think is good enough for you to get started to just get the feel on how to use many chat and also how to use a chatbot for your business and for your facebook page right and yeah before i end thank you so much for watching uh, do subscribe to this channel turn on the notification bell if you like content like this i really appreciate it because it will help my channel grow and so that i can keep producing content like this so that I can help more people right to provide more value into the marketplace and with this thank you very much for watching see you in my next video subscribe goodbye